Put a smile on your face when you're moving from place to place. place. Good morning, good morning, morning, good morning. Good morning and welcome back to Youth Wednesdays on this Big Updates Morning Show. You're viewing us live here in Portmore, Scarborough. Um, this morning we are going to a more sporty, a more uh, relaxed feeling. As you can see, I'm dressed in all my uh, my sporty attire, just with a jacket on top, just to make it a bit edgy. Um, this morning we are talking with Miss Sharicia uh, Irvin um, about the golf intercall um, for... To be a good, this initiative seems very interesting. Good morning and welcome. Good morning and thank you for having me. It's a pleasure to have you this morning. Um, so quickly, um, unfortunately, we, we don't have much time, but you know we'll make it worthwhile. Um, but just quickly tell us about yourself. I am Charissa Irvin, the CEO of Irvin's Golf Academy and the site director for LPGA USGA um, Gills Golf. Okay. All right. So. How long have you been in golf? How long? Have uh, you... I have been in golf since tender age of seven, playing um, golf as an amateur. Then really? I furthered my study, and I um, came came back to um, introduce the game and grow the game in Tobago. Okay, okay, that's great. Um, and you know, is this initiative new to Tobago? Um, yes, the school golf intercall is new to Tobago, and it's first time held in yeah Trinidad but, you and Tobago know, because it. I, we, growing up, I only knew of golf on TV. Yes. And, you know, it, it just shows that golf is not as niche mm -hmm. in Tobago as other areas. Yes. Um, you know, and, and that it is, it is great that you're trying to bring this thing to the fore, right? Um, so tell us about this initiative and why is it important? All right. Um, this is the first golf school, mm -hmm. school golf intercall. Mm -hmm. um, this initiative came about it. I just um, playing around, um, thinking what can be done for the kids. Um, I teach um, 11 schools, pre and primary currently. And um, they are all excited for the game and usually have a stigma behind the game of golf, that golf is a boring sport. But until you play it, you're going to know that it's a difficult sport and it's a real mental sport um, per se. All yeah. right. And um, so I teach pre and primary school. So the preschools, you have to have fun to keep the children going, yeah. and as well at the primary school. So I say, OK, let me put in everybody having an intercall. So what about the golf intercall or yeah. golf really? And, and, and that's that is, that, that the top notch yeah. of the whole quite intuitive. Um, yes, yeah, quite intuitive. Um, intercall. So um, I am excited also to see how it's going to come out, The um, especially I'm confident in myself, especially golf really. I am. Um, excited to see tell us about that, that though um tell us about the i mean we don't know about golf yes um i i remember when i was in in ue i had a short very short stint very like a couple of minutes well all a couple right. of hours you know just trying to Put the ball so, yeah all right. the thing was hard <laughs> it's like what so how are you how tell us about the the different um elements that makes up golf and and so on quickly yeah. All right, so um, friends, we have um, putting, mm -hmm. um, that's complete a hole. Um, that's the green where you see the flag and stuff like that. Right. And we have, we in the school, I usually treat it putting and the chipping um, currently, right? So um, the element make up the basics of golf, where they get in the posture, the setup, the aim, mm -hmm. and being able to get hands and eye coordination to actually roll the ball or hit the ball. At first chance, sometimes yeah. persons miss it. Yeah. But we usually, in the school, we use the, um, the fake golf club and a sponge ball um, to prevent the children from getting injury, injuring right. one another. All right. Um, you, you, you're targeting pre preschool, primary schools, and uh, clubs. Is there any reason as to why those that, that age group um, was chosen? Um, currently, that's the age group I teach. I am um, teaching okay. the pre and primary. I'm trying to um, have it back into the um, school. secondary schools so they can do it for CXC as you pick PE. You can pick golf for CXC wow. also. So, um, and the pre and primary school, they, uh, I want to keep them engaged and especially to grow the game of golf in right. Tobago. And, and that's, that's a great feat because yes. 
you know, um, when you don't know about something, there's a, there's a bit yeah. of a pulling and Pull tugging. Yes, and um, you are quite very much, um, you know, tasked with a very magnanimous responsibility. And that's great. Um, you know, I, I do think that golf would lend to the already existing sport, sports on the island. And I think it would help make the Tobagonian more, uh, more all wrong in terms of the, its sports and its offerings. Right. Um, you know, but, but d who are your participating schools? All right. Thus Currently, far? we have four preschools, um, Little White Diamonds Preschool, mm -hmm. Little Jewels, and okay. Bright Gem, and Douglas Hope. Those are the four preschool, and the primary schools are um, Signal Hill Primary School, right. Wim and the Cullen, um, St. Nicholas Private Primary School. We have Golden Lane um, Primary School. We have St. Patrick Primary School. And um, yeah. um, that's, those are schools we have currently. Yeah, so, so uh, unfortunately, we only have two minutes to this oh. interview. Um, and quite unfortunate, quite unfortunate. But um, is, is there any particular, you do, you, would you like to shout out your sponsors, anybody um, yes. in particular? Um, I would like to say thanks to all the sponsors. Um, first and foremost, um, thanks to Warner's Hardware. Um, this initially is Cool Intercol. Um, was to be held in 2020 mm -hmm. due to the pandemic it was cancelled and they jump on board first on right. at that time so i want to thank um warner's hardware i want to thank montoven golf course i want to thank um the nello's um rental also tobago glass for sponsoring um nigel Pajo um for sponsoring um also uh, may his soul rest in peace um, the Girls Golf LPGA, um, mm. Blue Heron, Dominion Appliance, um, Sunshine Tobago, Sunshine Trinidad. I want to say thank you to KG Enterprise, um, wow. as well as Sports Fanatic, Blue Waters, um, Classic Design, and last but not least, Ocean Spray Tobago. Mm. I want to thank each and everyone for seeking the children interest and mm. growing the game of golf and nurturing, help nurturing for this successful event for the School Golf Intercol 2023. All right, all right. Um, you know, uh, given this short time, it was quite very much informative, and I, I love what you're doing. Congratulations in giving Tobagonians an opportunity to be the next ti Tiger, Tiger Woods, Woods or the Tigress Woods. Yes. You know, <laughs> um, you know congratulations in that feat. But, but finally, can you share with the viewers your number, if they so wish to be a part of your initiative? Um, you know, on the training. All right. Oh, uh, my number is 766-3946. You can find us on Instagram and Facebook, Irving's Golf Academy. All right. So, guys, it's 8 o'clock on the dot. You know what, it, what time it is, what's coming up next. Unfortunately, this brings us to the end of Youth Wednesday, Wednesdays and Tobago of this morning show. Thank you for viewing us. Thank you for giving us your support. And remember to share the live, share the live, share the live. Up next, we have GMT. Good morning to Beagle with Candice Jackson. Have a great day and all the best. <laughs>